I know. It's so off trend to wear skinny jeans, but guess what? For two reasons and two reasons only. One, I ain't got no clean laundry. I need to do laundry. Judge your mother. Don't judge me, okay? You're sitting at home looking at me. It's, girl, not me trying to read y'all and I don't have on a wig. Girl, hold on. Psych, I don't care. <laughs> skinny jeans i do like i i ain't gonna lie like they my emergency jeans you know what i'm saying they all, i'm always gonna have a clean pair because i just don't wear them anymore and i'm showing my age i don't care i'm from the 1900s okay i'm gonna start claiming my age say say it with me how about we we confess okay before our lord and savior our true ages leave yours down in the comment section below here we go i am hold on it's stuck in my throat. They say the first step is admitting the truth. Okay. I am 38. Hold on. It's almost there. <clears throat> A little anaphylactic. Whew. I am 27. Thank you. Bye. I didn't even tell you guys what I'm doing today. Girl. Friend. Sir, how you doing, sir? Because I know I got some sirs that watch my channel. Oh, and if you're new to my channel, how you doing? Double time. My name is Valencia. I'm from Florida. We're not all crazy. However, I do fall into the 97 percentile of crazy Floridians. So I can't speak for the non-crazy ones. But yeah, there's some 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 real low-key personalities here. But for the most part, we out here. We out chill. Um, I'm a real estate agent. I'm two years into my real estate career i just renewed my license you guys and now i can actually become a broker if i chose to um which i'm thinking about it. i'm thinking about it but anyway okay a little bit what else what else about me oh i have four kids they would do dirty right now but they're coming back on saturday i'm so excited and i don't know why i do this to myself um like the last week that i have the last couple of days that i have to myself that's when i decide to like actually do stuff <laughs> So today, I am going to the movies. And why didn't y'all tell me that you can go on Tuesdays and see the movie for the Lolo? Like, I'm a frugal girl. I got four kids. I'm not trying to impress none of y'all about how much money I can spend. What I'm going to do is show you how much money I can save, okay? And tell you what you need to do to um, get your credit right well. I can't help you fix your credit. You can fix your own credit. But, you know, little things that you can do here and there to, you know, get your credit aligned. But the first thing you need to do is go to your bank. If you have a bank, hopefully you're with a bank or a credit union or whatever, and talk to one of the financial advisors. Talk to a lender. See what you need to do. Because nobody knows your credit like you because some of y'all be lying. You will lie to your realtor and tell us what your credit is. And then when the lender pulls your credit, you already know what you got in your credit, friend. And you going off of what Zillow told you your credit score was. Who is, who is Zillow? Okay. Go to your bank. I'm just saying, go to your bank. You know, ask to speak to a lender, say, you know, I, I think I'm ready to purchase a home, but I need to see what I need to do to get myself ready to be pre-approved. If I'm in position to be pre-approved, to see how much I can be pre-approved for, it does not hurt to try. If you don't know where you are financially, how do you know if you will ever be ready? So, yeah, I digress. What was I saying? Oh, yeah, I'm going to the movies. I'm going to the movies, and I guess it's only like $6 on Tuesdays. Nobody told me. Um, Everybody's talking about the Barbie movie. Barbie, I'm a Barbie girl, and I'm grown, okay? Not saying that I don't want to see it. I'll wait. <laughs> I can wait on that one to come out. <sighs> but I'm real super, super grown, so I'm going to see Indiana Jones, okay? I'm that old, okay? I'm that nostalgic, honey. Temple of Doom, Indiana Jones. Indy! Man, y'all know what I'm talking about. The Indiana Jones movie, when the people was in the dungeon of the earth, and they put you in that little chain thing and spin you upside down and rip your heart out with they. How many of y'all play with y'all siblings? <laughs> Doing that? And then your sibling took it too far. Like, hold on now. 
You, you, you're really trying to rip my heart out. Go sit down somewhere. Mommy. <laughs> okay, anyway. I gotta uh, see what I'm smuggling in this movie theater. Allegedly, okay? Because some of y'all would love to see somebody in prison just because... You don't like somebody. Go to jail. You need to leave. You need to be arrested. Oh, my God. You smuggled stuff into the movie theater. That's illegal. Ain't nobody say nothing about your illegal ass daddy when you was growing up. He was in your life because nobody snitched on him. Oh, girl. I'm sorry in advance. I didn't mean to say that. Yes, I did. <laughs> Anyway, let's go um, fill my bag up. I ain't even got to stop at the store, honey, because I kind of knew I was going to go to the movie. So I got some things to stuff in my bag. The movie starts at 4, and I'm definitely being extra black today. It's 3.43, so I'm on color people time. And boom, she ready to go. She, hold on, let me check my elbows. She ready to go. Let me check my elbows do you need some moisturizer oh yeah do you need some moisturizer oh yeah put that jerkin on baby all right we really gotta go because uh, i mean the the previews are gonna be rolling aka the trailers so it's okay i got time but not too much time Do I have any perfume? Do I want to wear perfume to the theater? Do I want to smell nice? Yes, I do. Oh, because I already know some of y'all going to ask me about this wig. Don't. If you want to know about the wig, DM me. Because these people don't pay me a dime. Plus 99. Ooh, she fat, baby. They don't pay me nothing to promo, okay? But DM me on Instagram. I'll let you know. I won't be stingy. What I have in my bag. Okay. Gotta have some water to smuggle in. A piece of fruit because I mean why not and then I've got my favorite salad from Publix okay and, and then I'll, I'll pick up some napkins like it's 10 minutes I think the, the stuff is stuff is over with the trailers girl come on let's go and then I always bring a jacket and I always have on me some running shoes girl because you just never know <laughs> you got to be able to run up out of there fast you can't run in slides flip-flops aka chocolates <sighs> gotta be able to get from out of there it's not okay I hope I didn't miss anything I hope like the movie is like just starting Indiana Jones dial of Girl, I don't even know what it was called. Sir, friend, how you doing? Because I know I got some sirs and I can't be calling y'all girls, okay? Anyway, because I, res I respect your masculinity. It was a couple of weeks ago, um, a man in the comment section was like, my wife told me that that's, that's a term of endearment to a particular marginalized group of people. And I'm like, how you doing? It's, it's transcontinental now, honey. Like, it, it goes, be it's, you know, it's the culture now. When, thanks to Wendy Williams, who, you know, got it from a marginalized group. But, you know, she used it on her talk show. But I say, how you doing? Because I love Wendy Williams. And I mean it from the bottom of my heart. I don't know how she's doing lately. Oh, speaking of, I digress. Um, That was a good movie. I'm glad I followed my intuition and chose to see that movie i don't know it's very nostalgic for me because like i said i grew up watching indiana jones yes i grew up playing with barbies but harrison ford indiana jones uh -huh. yeah i'm choosing him all day it was really good i like how they incorporated his age him getting older how people may you know say little things about older people but still throwing in some nostalgia of the classic indiana jones movie and it wasn't set in like this time period the the, the 2000s 200 and no 2023s it was like back in the 60s 70s ish was it when when did people go to the moon yes i went to school but baby tch, what they don't teach you at school is what you really gonna need okay instagram youtube a 640 credit score or at least a 620 
Jesus, at least be a 600 credit score. And Apple Pay. You're going to need that in the future, Apple Pay. Yeah, if you're watching this from the time-space continuum whence you might have come from, definitely going to need Apple Pay. Oh, and Amazon. Go ahead and invent Amazon before somebody else does. <laughs> Girl, the way you move it, do it with no hands. I love the way you do it, do it with no hands. Girl, make that love. Mm -hmm. right, okay, anyway, <laughs> I don't know why that song popped up in my head. Child. Friend. Now, I'm not saying, don't this feel like an episode of um, Are You Afraid of the Dark? Nickelodeon. Circa the 1900s. I'm showing my age today. Yeah. That was a show I would go home and watch. <laughs> and be scared too. <laughs> it was the theme music. The theme music was the most scariest part of the show. Like everything else was like, oh, I knew that. Okay. It was like, that was like the Twilight Zone for kids. It was real PG-13. Like even G-rated, honey, G-rated. I got my bougie water on deck. Some of you keep asking me about this. Is it good? Is it carbonated? Does it lose its carbonation after you open it? No, friend. This is like the champagne of waters. This is like the Hennessy of waters, the McDonald's Sprite of waters. It's going to hit you in the back of the throat and ask you what your name is. Okay? Just saying. You have to like sparkling water. If you love sparkling water, you're going to love this water. Trust me. If you don't, if you don't even like water, first of all, go drink some. How about that? Go go drink some water, okay, with your kidneys need to be flushed out. Your pee yellow, child. It's dark yellow. Did you know that your pee is supposed to have a color? It's not supposed to be completely clear. This is a bottle again because I already know some people going to be like, what's the name of the water? Girl, you see it? Sarah Toga. At first I thought it was Sarasota because there's a Sarasota, Florida, but it's Sarah Toga. Don't ask me where they make this at. Earth earth it's all the same <laughs> you know i had to go to target no i don't have an addiction I don't, I don't i'm not claiming any sort of addictions none of that okay i bind that up in the name of jesus send it back to dry walking places i rebuke that okay in the mighty name of jesus no problem girl. i just got a little bit of money that's all <laughs> i did i gotta pay my youtube check baby um but beyond that, I got a little bit of money to spend for the children, for my kids. And thank God for that because it's back to school season for the kids. They go back to school, I think, mid-August. Uh, but I'm trying to get everything out of the way. I've got the twins' wardrobe and shoes out of the way. But I'm just going to wait for Julian and Max because, you know, they're older. Nobody wants to be dressed by their mama. My kids are extremely humble. I am always reminding them that. I got four kids, okay? I got four y'all and I'm on a budget. And budget does not mean broke. It's giving them some financial literacy, some some financial responsibilities. So I may just give Max and Julian their money and be like, okay, you guys have this much money to go shopping with. Go forth and 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 and, and do that. But of course I gotta chaperone the process because <sighs> Max will just buy Legos. And since they're coming back this Saturday, I wanted to get them some little baggies so that when I go pick them up from the airport, I have a gift to give them. Not necessarily a gift. Because I don't really call it a gift. They're always getting things. But, you know, I'm mama. I, sh I show up and just show them that, um, that I've been thinking about them. I've been thinking about them. I've been listening to what they've been saying and I'm so proud of how they handled themselves this summer through whatever adversities, the many adversities whew, that they had to go through, which some of the things I didn't even tell y'all, okay? Some of the things I won't tell y'all. Um, but I'm so proud of my kids. I'm so proud of them and I just want to, I just want to do a little something, something for them. I went to michael's and i picked up a couple of things for the twins because they're like crafty little people <laughs> and then of course again i went to target i got julian a video game do y'all have a son or a kid a girl whatever who's who's into these switch games 
he gonna have to, he gonna, ooh, baby, some chores for this, but he got this game. I got some new lip gloss. This lip butter is everything, child. I don't know why, I don't know if it's dehydration, but like my lips have been very ashy lately. I got a belt to hold my pants up, because I'm, I'm kind of losing weight, girl. I got this cute little shirt just to, you know, throw on and go. It's really cute on. I got another shirt. This one is really cute on. It looks like a tablecloth, like a little doily. It don't look about nothing, but when you put it on, it's really cute. It's off the shoulder. It's got little holes and little frillies. It's super feminine. I'm in my overly feminine era right now. Like I just love anything that's super feminine that just says, you know, take me out to dinner, baby. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So, oh, and then I got some snacks. So I know I'm gonna be snackish, even though I had the salad in the movie theater. And I've been I've been doing a lot of fasting lately, so I don't get too hungry, but I got some little I got a box. A box of heart healthy trail mix. I don't know if I've ever shown you guys, but on my under my nightstands, there's like a free space underneath. So I like to have waters and like trail mix snacks. They're all individually packaged. I like it to feel like hotel esque. One day I'll do a little a little video on it. Um, <clears throat> I don't know why. I just wanted a slim gym. I just I haven't had one of these in so long, child. I just want one. I just want one. Ooh, it's opening. Oh no. Ooh, okay. Step into a slim gym for you. Y'all remember that? I remember that. Okay. Mmm. 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 This is not the spicy one. I need this to be a little bit spicier. I thought this was a spicy one. Okay. Anyway. And yes, I'm hiding my trail mix from my mom because she will eat all of my trail mix and then be like, "Well, I, I'll go to the store and then never go to the store and never replaces it." And I'd be so mad. I really do. I'd be so mad inside. Like. You ain't thinking about nobody else. You lucky I like you. <laughs> but but she's just that girl, honey. <laughs> Don't have some snacks because Gigi, Gigi going to eat the snacks. The healthy snacks, that is. She's going to eat them all. And then she's going to look. Look at you like. Anyway, child. I'm going to see y'all tomorrow okay make sure you guys thumbs up the video leave your comments down below um and i will see you guys tomorrow also connect with me on instagram if you're not following me no pressure no pressure no pressure or whatever um but yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow